Hi, I'm Sarah Coffey and I currently work at Goodwill Industries. I started in public accounting in 2007 um, out of Franklin College. I actually became a CPA because I tried math and the numbers were too hard. So I liked people and I liked math and I didn't want it to be complex, um, though some days simple addition and subtraction can seem very complex. Um, and that's why I got involved, but it's so much bigger than that now. Um, and now I feel like I'm really helping people um, manage their budgets within a big organization. And it's also helpful when providing advice to others, um, just friends and family as well. I found it very helpful that I had started in public accounting as it provided me with a vast knowledge base um, and the people I worked for exposed me to a lot. Um, and I attribute a lot of what I do today to the experiences there. I got to work with a variety of clients um, and found that my passion lied with working with not-for-profits. Um, the leaders were always more passionate and more willing to improve and take the advice that we gave them to heart and wanted to seriously improve their organization. Um, and I feel like Indianapolis has a great number of not-for-profits that truly serve a need in the area. And so I, I just knew um, my passion was with not-for-profits and that if I was going to invest so much time and energy, I needed to be with a not-for-profit. Within Goodwill, most people know our retail stores, um, which is a big part of what we do here. We also have a um, distribution center down the road um, where we hope to employ people that may not be able to find jobs due to disabilities or criminal background. Um, we also help to operate Goodwill Education Initiatives, which has several charter schools underneath it. We plan to open a couple more in the coming year. Um, and we also have a new program, Nurse Family, which I'm highly involved with, um, that works to place um, moms that might need a little more guidance um, ac across the entire pathway of birth and early um, childhood and kind of bridge that gap so that we hopefully don't have um, students that need the Excel Center coming back that have um, face difficulties. We want to try to go from the beginning of life to the end of life as we also help a lot of seniors find jobs and maintain jobs. Um, another part of what I do is work with the Goodwill Foundation which is our um, investing in money and of the chain around Goodwill. So I do a lot of the accounting work for the foundation as well. I've always been active with the Emerging Leaders Alliance and right now serve on the task force. Um, just this morning I spoke to a high school class in Zionsville where I live and tried to tell them how awesome the accounting profession and the CPA designation is. Um, and I feel like that's just very important to uh, carry on the profession if we want it to be strong in the coming years. We need to educate people. Um, if you're like me, I didn't know about the accounting profession very much in high school, so I go and answer any types of questions and I always make trips out to different colleges when available. It's just an easy way. All you have to do is talk and you guys, the society provides the presentation, so take a couple of hours once a year. It's a great way to get back. I am getting married in July to another CPA, so trying to prepare for a wedding during busy season has been taking a lot of free time, but it's been a lot of fun. I also am an active beach body coach, so um, in my free time, which is not much right now, I also help to build that market and um, that helps to channel my passion for fitness and health and nutrition. Um, so I'm always looking to promote that throughout my day-to-day -day activities. And I think that exercise has always been a, an important part of my life and I know it, it improves my quality of life and stress release. Um, but excited to transition into the next phase of life and with another accountant. So we'll see what that brings.